Al Magni will continue to serve as War 10 counselor. In his words, this is why he put over $8,500 on the library credit card. I wanted to be a big shot. I wanted to be a player. I wanted to be important. I wanted to impress you guys. I wanted to impress everyone. I wanted you to think that I was a big deal. And I wanted you to respect me. I didn't get that respect because I didn't deserve it. Many on council have made it clear they believe he no longer has any credibility. You know, he's got a lot of rebuilding of trust that he's got to achieve here, and he needs to do that uh, if he wants to be able to put forward ideas or pass, uh, pass motions, and, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be a difficult task for him to do. If he brings up something that he wants done either in the ward uh, or across the city, uh, then he will need the, at least five more votes to get that done. I'm just wondering if he can get those. Maggie will not represent the city on any boards or committees, but says he will work to regain the trust of council and his constituents until the next election. I intend to deliver this solemn apology and statement of contrition to every single one of my constituents in person. The people of War 10 put me here, and the people of War 10 will decide what happens to me. I share in their disappointment, I share in their frustration, but there's nothing that's available to us as a council. There's no provision in the Municipal Act that says that the mayor can have a council removed or the city council can have a council removed. Magny has repaid all charges and says he plans to repay any interest and the increased cost of the library audit. Maureen Regier, Blackburn News.